Hey guys, how's it going? This is Mix a Song with Mix It Up Gaming. We are back here on Life is Strange, picking up right where we left off on uh, the previous episode. So if you guys haven't seen that episode, go check it out. Lots, 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 lots of stuff happened. I can't stress enough. If you just hop into the middle of these episodes, nothing's going to make sense. Trust me. So let's hop right back into it. Uh, we're going to go take a lock walk with Chloe. Well, it looks like, uh... I can't believe you basically gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me. Especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me Come down. Come on, I wasn't gonna shoot him. And I just liked having that gun, man. Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe... Why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. All right, backstory. Let's do this. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. The fuck was that sound? Can we build another pirate board and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? Um, freaked out. I'm definitely going with freaked out. I'm still freaked out about what happened. That was awful, Chloe. I'm sorry. But Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying oh, Frank. Oh, shit. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers. Obviously don't get my pot from you, remember? <laughs> anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? You don't mean you... Ah, oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. Oh, phew. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I think it's shaky as sh or yeah, fried. I'm going with fried. I don't know anymore. My brain is so fried from all of this. I need a mental <laughs> enema. Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens, and it's like no time has passed. That's what good friends do. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Why? Let's find out why. Why? I bet she would hate me. You're not that different. Mm -hmm. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at night. Look at the beef coat. Yeah. <laughs> I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Afraid of what? Whoa, whoa, what's going on? Man, that is scary and intense to say the least. Oh shit, oh shit, shit, shit. What are you stuck on? Take off the boot. Oh no, that's a train. A train. Oh shit. Um 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 um. What can we do? What can we do? Get me out of here, Max. What the? F can I go back in time? Find something. Oh shit. Like what? Ooh. 
Can I do that? Okay. Uh, nothing there. How about in here? Awesome. It's not locked. Short something out. Short something out. Uh. I better find the tool to cut those wires. <sighs> Fuck. Seriously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yelling is not helping. Something here? Anything? Anything at all? Seriously, what the fuck am I supposed to do here? Max, get me out yep. I'm just gonna keep on doing this, cause this. I think if I rev oh crowbar, that's Max, what I need. I can definitely use this bad boy. All right. Max. Have the crowbar. Can they? What the fuck am I gonna use a crowbar for? The train's coming! Max, please! <sighs> Seriously. <gasps> crowbar. Get me out of here! I can't even move it with this crowbar? For God real? fucking damn it, what am I supposed to do? Now, all the way back. Where? Okay, so I got a crowbar. Ooh, crowbar here. Can I do that? Uh, oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Clippers, clippers, clippers. Come on, Max. Come on. Open, 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 open. Yeah, bingo. That's what I need. Take those. Now I can pull a toy okay. MacGyver. Please, so just keep on rewinding time. I don't care if it hurts. Open. God damn it. Open. In and out, no problem. That's what I'm talking about. Time warp to the max. Come on, yeah, 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 yeah. I gotcha. Liars. Uh, we got time travel. Cut them all. Oh yeah! First shot. Oh. No idea if this is gonna help. I did it. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. You okay? You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Way too fucking close. That's for goddamn Aren't sure. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time <sighs> with you, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. BFS oh. forever. Yes. Oh, it's starting to rain. That's not good. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be boring. So boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Uh, I don't know. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? I <sighs> wish I was. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos yes. theory? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I? <laughs> Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a Damn straight. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best <laughs> in my life? 
Because we're back in action again. BFS for life. That's what I'm talking about. Now come on, girl, get out of the rain. Holy shit, that was intense. So fucking intense. Oh god. Is that is that Princess Bitch? I need to find a good name for her. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. Alright. Um Wandering it is. Let's go. So are you going to that vortex? Let's go talk to Principal. Like I would miss it. I have this sir. Oh, hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. Uh, I should have. No. No. I'm not going to stir no, up shit anymore. Glad to see you weren't about to accuse another student of something. Yeah. Either. Now, if you excuse <sighs> me. Fucker's being paid off. Fuck you. You're corrupt as shit. Hey, Justin. Uh, no. Talk poster? Okay, so that's the, the club thing that's happening. Man. These elite assholes throw a lot of big parties. Another chance for Nathan Prescott to dose yes, somebody. Yes, yes it is. Hi, Trevor. Hey, let's talk to, um, Courtney. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. Yeah, I do. I do. I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Why you gotta be so rude? That's unnecessary. Alright. Hey, Courtney. Yep, okay. Skip, skip, skip. Really? Oh, skip, skip, like skip. You... Dress code? I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Thanks, Mats. I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell you what, I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Sweet! Cool. Thanks, Courtney. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. That snow was so insane. We... Seriously. Hello, climate nope, change. Okay. I'm just kind of exploring, seeing what there is to to see. And that's the, the same girl. Uh, I don't care. Ooh. Yeah, let's talk to him. Hello, Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your yeah. camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sex in Victoria. Um, I won't. I won't. That's what Victoria Damn wanted. straight. Yeah. I noticed she kind of set up her <laughs> own drama. Even if it fucks her over. Weird. She doesn't have to, though. That's what I don't get at all. When she's hot, rich, talented, what more does she need? Anyway, see you at the game Friday, Max. He's got to be a football player. Yep, these are all football players. Okay, anything else interesting at all? Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Yeah, I'm just kind of exploring because um, Soldy told me that it is always a good thing to explore. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? Do you mind if we talk about what happened yesterday with Chloe? Yeah. I mean... You hit Chloe. I'm sure she told you why. Did she mention... she probably stole one of my guns? You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. Let's just ask. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. 
That's all, Max. No, he doesn't seem as bad as when we first ran into him the first couple times. Uh, sit down. <laughs> Sci-fi now. No, no, no. Okay, so he's in the. Okay. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. Right. Let's uh. That reminds me. I have to that score some weed from Nathan. Science class. Okay, let's go in here. Well, let's talk to Miss Grant. Can we? Yeah, let's talk to Miss Grant. Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking Why? about you, Max. It's too bad you didn't sign the petition. Every signature counts, and yours might be the one that decided. How's your campaign going? It's missing somebody who should care. But no finger pointing. You kind of are. More people would rather send a text than sign a petition. That's how they keep us all distracted. Nobody will notice cameras on every square foot. Some of us want to use our cameras for good. But people like David Matson want to use them as spies. Man, there is a, a lot of button I'm not heads. Like him, Grant. I know, Max. But the trick is to make sure Blackwell Academy does not end up like him. True that. I'm just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. Oh, this is my favorite time of year. I do love the season change. This whole campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. You must know Mr. Jefferson pretty well by now. I certainly know him as a talented artist and terrific teacher. I've been here a little longer. But he's made a bigger mark. I have to say, it's not quite autumn enough. Yeah, yet. That's true. Uh, let's ask about snow. Heck, why not? What about that snow yesterday? What's your scientific explanation? Our climate is moving beyond explanation. Of course, some of the tribes here might see it different. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but I have to get going. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon. Looking forward to it. Alright, where's Warren? Think, big brain. Think. Let's talk to Warren. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Okay. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Um, well, well, we got time travel. I have a vision. Godium. Godium? That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is. Please don't explode. Please don't explode. Damn. Zip. All right. Time travel. That's what I'm talking about. Can't be that hard. Hey Warren. All right, skip. We've already seen it. Skip. We've already seen it. Asking skip. Me for help means you have skip. To a bit of pota Potassium. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. This works. You get a free hug. Sounds like a plan. Oh. Weird science. Okay, bitch. Where's my hug? Yes, I am a scientist. Fuck. <laughs> oh, you owe me a hug, boy. Let's talk to Brooke. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your yes, daily rounds? I'm helping Warren with his latest experiment. Oh, I guess he needed a neophyte assistant so he wouldn't be threatened. But you came to his rescue anyway. Yeah, <laughs> my nature. Apparently, it's my nature. Yet, Warren ignores the experts right in front of him. Not that he would ask me for help, anyway. Yeah, it's just an expert experiment. I need to know if you can help me with the potassium experiment. No can do, Max. I'm all about robotics, not chemistry. Give me a drone over a beaker. Ditto. Ditto. I hate to hit and run, but... Don't let me get in your way. So long. All right, let's get out of here, get to our class. Whoa. I'm trying. 
But you have to understand my position. Can we go after her? Why? You don't understand her. mine. Nobody hey, hey, does. Hey. Nobody. Hey. Hey, I'm right here. I'm right here. Please leave me alone. Okay. Can't say I didn't try. Let's talk to him, see what's up. Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. You look worried. No, no, it's okay? not. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Yep, yes we did. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most oh, yeah. soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral yes, video? Yes, yes. Kate is freaked out. Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding uh, back the truth. This is not good. Have you talked to her? Yeah. Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. And yeah. It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girl's bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? We should take a I picture. I would never make something like this up. I'd like to believe that, Max. It just seems like there's a lot of drama around you this week. Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. Hello? Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Well, okay then. Can we can we eavesdrop? Uh huh. Feel like eavesdropping. Sure. Okay. Is he is he gonna say anything? Listen, I do have a class I have to teach. I have to go. Okay. Mhm. Mm okay. I'll do that. There's something fishy going on around here. Oh. I know. That makes sense. I don't like this. Huh? Mm -mm. Uh. Seriously, I have to hang up now. Okay. Let's talk about this later. We'll talk later, okay? I have to go. There's something definitely going on around here that I'm not like. Yeah, okay, he's in a loop. I'm not gonna. Okay. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Boom. 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 Let's talk to Hayden. I'm Katina. You are out of control. Left, Whatever. Whatever. Right. Show me the love. How do you think Max uh. will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh, I'm sure she'll report us to the. Uh, let's talk to douchebag and. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch in life. Uh. And paparazzi. I want that photo whore or I get nasty. Bitch, I don't care. Too late. Oh, burn. Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. In fact, shit's just starting, Max. Ass Damn straight. That's what I'm talking about. I mean, this is just going to be a PSA, but if you are those two people... And you are like that. I will punch you in the face if I see you. Just get that clear right now. Okay, what why the is David fuck? taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong. 
and weird. So, okay. I'm sitting here doing nothing. Can I can I touch anything? Can I do anything? Oh, hey Warren. What up, Max? Hey Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. I'll we see have a lot to cover today and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> I guess Kate will miss class now. Sounds like you're giggling I'm about worried a about her. Viral. Maybe it involves a student? Let's draw. Or a friend? I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usually, people need something to do. Okay. No smartphones in class, Max. I was reading no that. I learned judge so they never take a good look at themselves we can thank reality tv for some of that in the end we can only blame ourselves for participating <laughs> speaking of participation there are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest like max caulfield for example who i know can't wait to enter right hey hey we got that deer photo I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a harry potter book so you must know today we're studying hero skier who that beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girl's door! What? Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever no, no, again. I'm gonna go. What Listen, the hell's going on? Everybody remain seated. Oh shit, is this... Oh my god, is it Kate? Dismissed. Oh fuck, is it Kate? Is this for real? It slipped out. I didn't think she was that messed Oh up. fuck. I'm not gonna do a cliffhanger, guys. We're just gonna see what's going Oh fuck. Oh no. no. Oh shit. She can't die. She can't. Man, the power is freaking. Not again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. There's got to be some point I can rewind to. Whoa. Um. What is going on? Keep going, Max. You can do it. Holy shit, I've stopped time. Okay, uh, let's see. I can't touch anything that's frozen. I gotta get up there. There's gotta be some way for me to get up there. Can I? Can I? Okay, so I gotta go around this way. Come on, Max. Hold it together. Hold it together. Hold it together. Oh, can I get up there? God damn. Yes. Can I stop her? I'm going to try to grab her. Can I grab her? There's got to be some way to stop her. It can't happen like this. It can't happen like this. Go grab her. Stop her. Be the superhero. Uh, what are you doing here, Max? Stop. Don't come near Why? me. Not now. It won't work. I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself. Seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. 
Nothing matters. No, you matter. You matter. You matter. And not just to me. I do want to believe that. Hey, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. Like I helped by erasing all that crap people wrote on your room slate. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. Come on. That makes me feel better. You're definitely my friend, hell yeah. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. <sighs> We're gathering proof. Kate, I'm gathering proof that Nathan Prescott drugged you. And you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Nathan Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. You have proof now? Soon. Then straight to the police. Think of it like we're cleansing Blackwell. You do have my back, Mac. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So I want you to come with me now. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm already on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Just be strong. Be strong. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? No. Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Everybody. What about your mother, Kate? You'll destroy her. She doesn't care about a video. She loves you. You don't know my mother at all. She already thinks Satan has me on the fast track to hell. Hey, 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 no, 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 don't walk backwards. No. Kate, please stop. Listen, this isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. Nice try, Max. But God put me on this route. Oh, shit. Oh, God damn it. Why do we have to come to religion? This is one thing I don't know anything about. Um, Let's go with this one. Nice and... Suicide is a sin, isn't it? If you believe in hell, you might end up there. I don't want that to happen. What difference does it make? I'm already in hell anyway. Yeah, I should have gone with one of the proverbs. God oh. damn it. Come on. Come on. Come on. God fucking damn it. I don't know what to say, guys. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us, but we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh before she did what she did. Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police inquiry. I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. We need to find out why Kate Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my... No, fuck you. You're bought out. I take the well-being of every student more uh, No, you don't. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, 
As our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not, and that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the roof with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. Well... <sighs> right for the jugular. Right for the jugular. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're playing a liar. the field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and fellow student is dead. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me. But I think I can use my power again. Mm. I'm I'm sticking with the jugular. I'm sticking with the jugular. Fuck that asshole. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. Fuck you, prick. Alright, guys. That's going to do it for this episode. It was a harsh episode. By far. I'm not going to try to dazzle it in any way. I know it's a video game. It rem Please remember, it's a video game. Um, I did what I could to stop her. I know there is very little I could have done. Uh, but when it comes to religion, I have almost no idea. So if the one of those proverbs might have saved her, then... I'm I'm sorry. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying this. It's getting super heavy, and as far as I've been told, it's not going to get any lighter. So if you guys are down for the grind, I am too. And if you guys are enjoying this video series, leave a like, leave a comment what you think's the you know what's going to happen next, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.